Today we will talk about Flickify, which is a brand new product from uh, Ezoic. It allows to turn your articles into amazing uh, videos, as you can see on their website. So we'll see how it works. We'll see together how to turn one article, an example, into an amazing video that will then rank on uh, search engines such as uh, uh, Google results for video. You will also get your own video platform created only for, new, for your website automatically for free if you use a Flickify along with, uh, or you can also use Ezoic Video to host your own videos if you have, for example, your YouTube channel or whatever. And uh, you can turn your articles into videos and add them to your library of, of uh, videos and to your own video platform, which allows you full control and maximum ad earnings on your video because there is no minimum uh, minimum of uh, views or uh, of subscribers or whatever. You can directly for free with a few clicks turn your, uh, your website and your videos into your own video hosting platform. So let's have a look how it works for free. It's a, uh, right now, as of uh, beginning of uh, October 2022, it's a brand new product. And let's see how it works. So for example, I have this, uh, this article. So it's a day tour of the uh, v uh, city of Pripyat in Ukraine, the city of uh, Chernobyl. And we'll turn this uh, virtual visit with a few pictures into a video uh, with a voiceover. Uh, so basically reading the text that I wrote about my visit of, of this uh, the Pripyat city. So what we have to do is to log in on the Ezoic dashboard. If you haven't done so yet, you can create, uh, you can submit your website to Ezoic to be an Ezoic publisher for free. And once uh, you will be uh, accepted, you have to integrate your uh, website with, uh, with their system so they can, uh, on your behalf, uh, optimize your website or host your videos and show the videos you've hosted on their platform as uh, videos hosted on your website, which is my case. So if you do so, then you will have a page like this. So this is my uh, video platform created automatically by Ezoic. So as you can see, it is on my domain name and all my videos are ranked on, uh, on search engines such as Google Video and I compete directly with YouTube. And now we can create automatically one video. So for example, a virtual visit of uh, the city of, of Pripyat. So all I have to do is copy the URL of my article on my website, go to the Ezoic dashboard, open the Flickify tab, which is brand new, and here simply select create a new video. So I can create a video from scratch, from nothing, or I can create it using my own article. So here my article is this, this one. I paste my URL, I click on go. The system will find the text. So in my article, there's a lot of text. So it's selected automatically some text. I can add uh, text, I can remove text, I can play with it. On the left side here, I have the full text found in my article. And on the right side, I have the text that the system has automatically selected. So for example, this is just a, a link, an external link. So I don't want it uh, as a slide. And here, each paragraph at the end will be uh, translated into one slide in the video with voiceover and uh, if possible with a uh, with a picture taken from my article, or if not, I can, uh, we will see after, we can uh, import, import, uh, um, uh, import illustrations. So let's select this. And now the video is being automatically created. So automatically, Ezoic is creating slides. So each paragraph is one slide with one picture when possible, when it could have been taken in my, um, in my article. So on the uh, left side here, you can see, uh, uh, the uh, media library so i can add more uh, images or videos uh, that are free to use so stock pictures or stock videos so uh, by default it puts uh, some uh, keywords from the first paragraph but in my case i want to uh, search for uh, for uh, medias related to the city of pripyat so as you can see there is a lot of pictures that i could use and same for videos if I search for videos of Pripyat, there is a lot of videos, but if I don't have enough uh, pictures of videos to illustrate my own slides, I can use them. So let's have a look, slide after slide. You can see for the first two slides, it imported pictures from my article. The next one, there is none. So let's add, for example, a video. All I have to do is select the video or the picture and drag and drop it to the slide. So next slide, there is a picture. The slide after, there is nothing. So it's about the amuse amusement park. So let's try to find a picture about uh, Pripyat amusement park. We have to scroll down a little. So what we can do also, um, so we can see here that for uh, several slides, there is no picture that has been automatically imported from my article. So I can go here to the bulk edit. 
uh, no, sorry, here to the settings. Here in the settings, I can uh, first of all select the voiceover. So if I click, I'm not sure if you will hear, but I will try. Hi, Hi. I'm Matthew. Okay. So the um, robot uh, with this voice read some text just to show you how the voice will sound. I'm not sure if you heard it in this video, but uh, you can try it for yourself. So you can select the voice. There are a lot of voices with various languages. For example, I like this uh, female voice. Uh, this text is in English, so it will be in English. I can also add a soundtrack. Well, I should actually add the soundtrack. So I should add one track per uh, scene found in the Article usually they found two scenes. It can be up to three. It's um, usually good to, good to stop at around two three scenes. So the video is about uh, five uh, five minutes long. So I can play them or add them. I know them, but I will just add a few songs. So the songs will play in background and the voiceover will be on top of the sound. Will be much louder than the sound. You can see that the music is only played at twenty percent volume. So I can add some uh, music and what is very interesting, I, so I can also change the theme. Let's just have a look. There are various themes for the background. The one by uh, default in this case is fine for me, but if I want, I can choose. More themes will be added in the future, of course, along as a voiceover, as a stock pictures or st stock videos, everything. But what I want to show you here is this experimental feature. By clicking on auto match, if possible, the, uh, the system will automatically search for media sets, so images or videos, to uh, match the, um, the slides which have no, um, no illustration. You can also replace existing media if you want. But let's uh, try here uh, just for the, <laughs> for the sake of uh, this video. And you can see that it's very fast and uh, most slides have had a picture or a video automatically taken from the uh, stock. So it's very interesting. With a few clicks, you can easily have a full video. Once you are done with your edits, all you have to do is to uh, is to here click on preview, and it will take a few seconds. The system will generate a preview with what you have selected, with your text, with your slides, with your voiceover, uh, with your uh, pictures, with your videos, everything you can. As the nuclear and see how it is. Their so uh, Some yeah, parts of the song can be lot, safely um, visited because without I'm sure if I'm recording my computer, let's try to be tired. So, the unique experience during the ghost town of Tripiat is both yeah. frightening and inspirational. So, I, uh, <laughs> I will assume that you heard something. So, this is what the video will look like. And all you have to do is to click on I'm done render my video. You can select, uh, well, by default it is checked, but you can um, get an email or not when it's rendered and publish it automatically on, or not on the Ezoic video network and on the internet and uh, be rank, uh, get your video ranked for your keywords on your website on search engines by publishing it when it is rendered. So this is what I want to do. Let's render the video. And now that's all. You can uh, go back uh, to, the, to your Ezoic dashboard. And uh, if you go to uh, manage videos, here you will see the videos that are being created. So here the video is being rendered. And once it is rendered, so let's not let's not uh, wait. Let's go right away to the media library. Once it will be um, uh, created. So if you go to, uh, if you know, I want to go to my videos. <laughs> so if you uh, sorry here if you go to to a video, you can still edit it afterwards if you want or not once it is done and of course if you change your videos and you will have to render it again so it is maybe um, maybe not not recommended and uh, once uh, done uh, you will be able to uh, to publish your video on, on your website. So that's all you have to do. It's pretty simple. And then you can uh, publish your video as you as you do with any video imported from YouTube, upload it from your computer or anything, add your keywords, uh, everything. So I already have uh, videos about that. So I recommend you, to, of course, to subscribe to my uh, to my channel if you haven't done it yet. I have already a video a review of the Ezric video player where you can see how to set up your video, add your, even add affiliate links on top of your video, get 90% of ad revenues instead of uh, anything between uh, 45 and 0% with uh, YouTube. So with Ezric, you, can, you get 90% of the uh, Google uh, AdSense revenue on your video. And, uh, yeah, and they rank for your website, they bring visitors, uh, visitors to your website to help you make more money. So I hope this video was useful. I, of course, recommend you to try Flickify for yourself and let us know in comments how the experience went for you. Thanks for your attention and share the video if it was useful.